Hello and welcome back to my Let's Play on Total War Shogun 2 with the Takeda on Legendary Difficulty. Where last time we left off, we were still at war with the Oda. We had managed to destroy their first big army, well, decent army, um, which was actually just a fantastic battle, really enjoyable. Uh, but now we have a second stack just sitting uh, next to our main force as well. Uh, I've I think I was gonna attack it, but I also think I recruited, yeah, I recruited two cav units here. So I think I was considering sending them over, and I don't think I can reinforce right now. So maybe I will actually just stay in ambush right here and keep these guys here, or probably even move out. Ah, eh, no, yeah, some cav is fine reinforcing, or maybe have these two guys reinforce obviously and have them sit on the road and then we sit at the ambush like that. Um, but yeah, I think that's what's actually gonna be the plan rather than attacking straight up, um, because that way. At the end of it, it, once we've had the battle, they're obviously going to run back, but we will have replenished immediately because we're in our own ter or in our own territory. So yeah, that'll, that should work out okay. Uh, our income is still trash, or it is trash now. It wasn't before necessarily, but I kept recruiting units, never stopping. Uh, but that's okay because we have some more uh, money-making buildings on the way. Like the lumber yard's going to be done next turn. So I'm not in a crisis or anything, but we do need to be careful that we don't spend all of it. And accidentally go bankrupt. So yeah, let's put these guys in the army. Um, I think two of these are definitely going towards Hida. Or towards the army Hida, but that's okay. Uh, and then you guys are just going to sit on the road. And you're going to be the ambush. Like so. Um, now, the only other thing I was considering, I believe, is getting uh, military access from the Jinbo. And just going to take Kaga. It does split us quite a bit. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, we can't reach it this turn, though. Even if we could. It's weird. It's actually telling me I can't walk into this. Am I somehow still allowed to walk into... Hold on. Uh, Jimbo. What's up? We, uh, they fucking hate me, so getting a deal from them is going to be difficult. I don't have any military access. Um, they don't like the way Sugi, of course, who are still my ally. Which is nice. I have... Just way too many allies. This is kind of a weird campaign. But that's okay. That's what I signed up for. Um, right, okay. Well, I, I, you know, the easiest way to usually do this is just uh, ask for five and offer ten. To come but before. they don't even want to do that because they hate you too much. Now that you're here. Even twenty, way they wouldn't do. So I, I honestly think that it's going to have to be... Oh, that's because I'm doing the wrong fucking thing like an idiot. That's... There you go. Ten for five does work. <laughs> I was like, uh, can I have 10 turns and I'll offer you 5. Um, okay, so 5 for 10 does work. So I, I, I could I could do that. So I asked for 5 turns and I offered them 10. Want to be my vassal again? <laughs> that panned out well last time, didn't it? Uh, I could increase relations by offering a marriage. I don't really necessarily f want to, though. I honestly would be okay if they declare war on me. Because I have a feeling their army's either dead or in the east... I didn't have a ninja around here. He's over here now. Because um, I need to do this now before the Atori come over here and do it. So yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send this guy back. Get some info on the way. There really isn't a whole lot here, so that's good. Their army isn't in there, so yeah, if they declare war on me, I'd be okay with that. I mean, there's a chance they take this place, actually. Uh, they, uh, they did have a, a decent army, I believe, at one point or another. Anyway, let's, uh, let's do the deal. I may be able to get some money out of them as well, to be honest, so... Uh, I, I will offer you 10, you had demand the 5. To come before me. Will you pay but me speak, a little bit of cash here. on top of that, since I'm offering you, you know, the bigger, the better part of the deal here? No? Okay. Um, I don't, no, I don't want to increase relations, so I'll just take the 50 bucks, to be honest. Alright. Cool. Now, let's get a fucking move on. How happy is this place? 13. We are 14... This is still going up, but it's we're going to stop that from going up soon. That's still going down, so yeah, we can move everything out right now with no issues. We may have to recruit a unit, but I don't want to move less than this out, I think. So let's just go all out. Um, and then I guess we'll just sit on the border. Although... Ooh, okay, here's the thing, right? So th th there's... Okay. There's two options here. I can sit... On the border in the Jimbo's lands, which means I don't take attrition, but there's always the chance the AI is like, oh fuck you, I'll break my trade or my agreement, and then all of a sudden my army gets teleported back and I'm nowhere. 
Alternatively, I could declare war on the Equiki, just sit in their territory, but of course that comes at the cost of taking one turn of uh, attrition. It's the lower risk uh, strategy, but I also, I mean, because the attrition probably won't even matter, let's be honest, because there's only three units here, they might recruit one or two more, but it shouldn't be too dangerous, but I also don't think I should throw away my men's lives. I'll take the risk of them breaking their treaty and me not actually being able to acquire the Equiki's land. But if they break the treaty, then I'll fucking just declare war on them and take their land, to be honest. Alright, so we're just gonna go ahead and sit there. There's minus one, but it'll be fine next turn. This will go up soon, but once we take out the Echo land... Sorry, and break the uh, Jodashinzu temple, it'll start going down again, so it should be okay. And then we only ever have to worry about Christianity. Oh, nice! It's nice when you can take care of the Equiki early on. Um... Okay, for a second I thought they owned this place, because the color here... Look, I mean, it's just, it's too fucking tiny, and then when you zoom in, it's clearly a different color, but when it was, when it was like this, I was like, fuck, is that a quickie? But no, it's not. It is not. Uh, anyway, so yeah, I'm not going to recruit any units. I don't think I really want to build any buildings either. I could upgrade this, but it doesn't really do anything for me. I might need my money for something else, although I could always cancel it if I have to, so... Uh, I think maybe that's correct. Also, I think after strategy defense, we're going to go for heaven and there so I can get my good units out. Especially if I'm taking Kaga soon. I can start recruiting really good units pretty early on, so... Let's upgrade that. With the potential of going bankrupt if something disastrous happens, but I don't think it will. Right, let's hope our ambush holds. If it doesn't, as long as they still attack me, that's okay. Oh, fuck you. You son of a bitch. Okay, well that's, that's still okay, I guess. I'll just go on the offensive. Oh, well, that's convenient. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, shit! Wait! Oh, okay. Um, hmm. God, okay, so many things now. Uh -huh. Okay, so here's the thing. I almost wanna... Oh my god, they recruited three units. I almost wanna just kinda let them be. Because if they take Etchu, then that means I can take Etchu from them with no downside. Um, I was hoping they would that would kill off the Etchu, or sorry, uh, the Jimbo, what do I keep saying? Yeah, the take Etchu, the town Etchu, but owned by the Jimbo. Because that would take out the Jimbo right away, but the Jimbo just took Echigo. Which means that, obviously they're not, they're not gonna, their clan isn't gonna die from taking out Etchu. The plan is still a solid one though, if I declare war on the Ikuiki right now, actually I need my ninja for this. If I declare war on him right now and take Kaga, which is definitely the more valuable town, um... Then this army will just disappear, the Ikuiki's dead. But, I don't know where that- Because if the Atori is on their way to take this place, then I'm just gonna do it. But it doesn't look like they are. So I think I actually- I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give them a turn. I think I might want to actually follow up on them. I'll take it after them, basically. I hope they didn't- Well, actually, if they declare war on me, it's whatever. Um, yeah, we're gonna- we're just going to take this risk. I don't want to move all the way. I want to make sure I can still get into Kaga next turn as well. But if I move like if I move closer, I can take this and run back towards this way. Um, yeah, I'm just going to block him in. Obviously, we're not at war, so I'm not actually blocking him in. But yeah, so they take that. I immediately take it from them, which shouldn't be too difficult. And then we run back and take Kaga as fast as possible before they recruit an entire army there. Kaga is definitely the more valuable target, so if this ends up backfiring and Atori show up and I can't take Kaga for some reason, then it's a bit annoying, but oh well. Uh, this is probably going to lose. Yeah, so this is going to gain one, but also lose. So this is still going to be zero next turn, so we're still okay for now. Right, this situation then. Uh, you should have actually done this last turn, because then you would have been level two by now, which probably wouldn't have made it much of a difference, to be honest, so don't die. Oh, nice. level up. And a bunch of spare experience, which is good. So we put one point in there and keep the other one. I think, yeah, that's how I used to level up my ninjas. Um, plus one to assassination or 10% chance being uh, undetected. That's definitely the more valuable one. Right, so here... Here's the thing. I don't want to waste any movement. I think if I put you in there, that's probably the, yeah, that's the least amount of movement wasted, so... We are going to go for it now. I'm not, I'm not recruiting any units, so I'm not waiting for anything. This is the time to attack. So we're going to go ahead and do that. 
We can move you out and still reach, and that's all good. So we can attack them. Uh, we have six units of cavalry. Obviously, two of them are supposed to go this way, but I, yeah, I'm definitely using them for this right now. There's six units of archers, so that's going to be very, very helpful. Uh, the two generals are not going to stand a chance either against these guys. They all have either experience or increased charge, so they're all like, you know, even a regular light calf, just without any upgrades, a normal light calf, not decayed light calf, a normal light calf will destroy a general one-on-one. -on -one. People often say to me that it doesn't work for them, and I don't know what they're doing wrong, because I've done it a billion times, and it, it's always... It, it's always favored towards the like half. The only downside they have is their morale drops a lot faster, but maybe keep a general nearby so they don't die, I guess, or don't rout, but... Anyway, uh, so yeah, the battle plan... Next turn is going to be an interesting one. Actually, no, this... Well, both turns. But yeah, this should be quite interesting next turn. Depends on what Jimbo does. I think they moved on immediately to take out uh, the Waisugi in Fukushima, I guess. I don't know if they still got their army. Who are they at war with? They're at war with the Satomi as well, which... Are they all the way down there? I guess they must be. I mean, normally they... I think the Satomi start... Is, did they start in Shimotsuke in Fukushima or one of the two? I can't remember. But they must have moved over because unless they don't really mind the Satomi... Like, these relationships with these people are actually okay. The ones- they hate the fucking people over here, but that's not the Jimbo or the Hatakiyama, so logic would say that that is the Jimbo, but the Jimbo- or the Satori Satomi Badulik? Not Jimbo. Badulik? What the fuck, I'm talking Dutch now. The- <laughs> the Satomi, I mean. I'm losing my goddamn mind over here. <laughs> the logic would dictate that this is the Satomi, is what I'm trying to say. Um, but I'm not sure if it is. It'd be kind of weird if they- don't hate the people they're at war with, and they hate some other random person a lot, but... Anyway... Um, they're allied to the Mogami, that's interesting. Okay, well, either way, the, the point being, they're probably gonna die soon. Because they're surrounded by enemies. Which is not necessarily good for me, because that would free these guys up. They will no longer be a vassal, and all of a sudden I've got another threat on my border. So we need to, we need to start dealing with some shit around here soon, because... Uh, I feel like we've had these plans to do shit for a while now, but nothing's really happening. It's in their favor. So you think, game. So you think. Alright, so we are obviously massively outgunned. If they have some massive hill with a force on top of it, it's going to be very annoying. But uh, they have eight units of Yari Sam. We have nine units of Yari Ishigaru. They've got one unit of Yari Ishigaru. And we got six archers. Yeah, we, we should be okay here. It's like, we have six cav against their six archers. The only thing that, like I said, would really be bad is a uh, particular kind of hill with, especially with forest on top. There is a hill here in the middle, which is why I kind of started stumbling my words there. They will probably start sprinting towards that, and I'm wondering if I should do the same. Because... They're gonna get there before me, but I can at least, like, kind of race them up there. The problem is, though, uh, I don't want rain. I would like some dry weather, please. Thank you. The problem is... Oh, fuck. Well, never mind. I, yeah, I'm reinforcing, of course. I can't make it up there. Well, never mind any of that stuff. We're just gonna be uh, left to the fate of the gods. They're all the way back there, but they're probably still gonna go towards the hill. Could tr maybe, nah, I was gonna say, maybe get some cab over there or something. Oh, someone commented something on the first video, uh, which went up, and oh my god, the, the um, response to that's been phenomenal, by the way. I want to thank you guys. Um, in uh, how many, like, that, if, yeah, the views and everything. God, I've been a bit of a slump recently with YouTube, but fuck me, that kind of that kind of made up for most of it, to be honest, that first video. It's uh, currently, it's been up for, I don't know, like 18 hours? Actually, yeah, literally 18 hours and 8 minutes just now. Um, and I think it just reached 4,000 views? Or was it 3,000 views? I think it's 4,000. Let me check. I'm just going to get my phone out right now. Halfway during the recording, why not? It is... Oh uh, yeah, over 4,000. 4 4.3 almost. Um, and that's, uh, that's pretty good. I can't complain about that. So uh, yeah, just a general thank you to all of you guys for uh, being supportive. A lot of positive comments and stuff as well. Uh, anyway, what was I actually going to talk about? It was something else I was going to mention. Oh yeah, right, someone, uh, yeah, someone told me something. Um, that I, in my 2,000 hours of playing this game, somehow didn't realize yet, and that is how to recognize 
who is the general in your or the enemy army? Obviously, yours is not really difficult because you click on the icon, but there's this thing on top of the flag. For me, it's a moon, like a half moon uh, crescent symbol, which indicates that's my general because you can see none of the other units have that on top of their thing. And the enemy doesn't. Wait, am I blind? Hold on. But wait, I. I. I what? Okay, never mind. This I'm confused now. Why does it not work now? They showed me. They told me, and I looked, and because I, I mentioned it in the 40th minute on the first episode, and um, and then I looked, and I was like, oh yeah, there's a unit that has a specific thing above their flag, and that was all, that was the Oda, the big Oda battle, um, in the first episode. Was that the Oda? I think it was Oda. Whoever it was. No, it wasn't the Oda. It was someone else. Doesn't matter. Um, they had a big fucking thing above their flag as well, but I don't see it now, so either I'm not close enough or something, or it's not relevant, like it's not actually something you can rely on. I don't know. I'm very confused now, to be honest. I was I was so I was so stoked with this news that I, or this new thing that I found out after 2,000 hours of playing. I thought I knew everything. Then I thought I was wrong, and now I'm not so sure anymore, because I don't actually see that icon at all. Uh, what I do know is this enemy is being really fucking weird here. They've got some archers coming towards me. Alright, let's have you guys run for a second, because I'm about to get shot. I don't like it. In fact, there's the first arrow. What are they doing? What is this? What are you What are you facing at? What, do I have something over here? What is going on? I mean, honestly, just kind of run back, I guess, and kill these archers, I think. Let's move, forward, lose, move backwards a little bit more. I'm actually using my generals as well. Oh, I'm being shot at. That's okay. Yeah, you guys shoot at my infantry. That's fine. I'll happily uh, take some shots on those. Alright, so you go straight. You're kind of sideways. You get in from like there. Get in. Get behind them. Actually, I want to do a downhill charge. No, let's get shot by the other units. I want to go up here and right in the back, but it's unnecessary because they're route before I even get there. And also, I'd get shot by the other units. So it's just not worth it. Well, that's two archers dealt with. Am I now close enough to see? No, there's still no fucking. Is this not the general somehow? What the, what the fuck is going on? I'm so confused. It was such a cool tip. I was so happy to learn something new. Only for it to be rudely snatched away again. Yeah, I don't know. That's weird. Uh, 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 yeah, I, I just, I, I just don't know. Anyway, they've um, they're shifting around. They're they're again. They're getting tired, which is good. I think I actually might just make use of the uh, the situation here and just move up a little bit. Because if they're running around, like as long as they're not stationary, they're running around. They're not shooting at me. So I might want to actually just try and get up there while they're doing all the shifting. Uh, they're doing some more. Although I think now they're just shifting to be like that. Yeah, pretty sure that's what's happening. I think I'm too far away to just straight up run towards them, but. Get the cab out to the flanks. Should actually just walk them for now. I could try and lure some archers as well. We have killed two of them so far, so there's only four more left. Uh, yeah, their, their line of Yaris just goes very wide. They've got a couple of units over here though, but I can't deal with them with just cavalry. So I'll need to get some units over here. They're still shifting around. They're facing towards my cab now, I guess. Well, I mean, just go further then. Look at that. That's a lovely block. This shouldn't here is missing a man, but other than that, that is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Got some more Yari Sam. They're gonna sit over here now, I guess. So they've shifted around again. Look again, the more they're moving, the better. Oh, we've got an archer. Uh, cavalry. Yeah, I'm actually gonna get shot now. That's okay. Uh, okay, let's just try and get up there as fast as possible, though. They do still have two more archers there, guarded by a single Yari, or, yeah, a single Yari, unfortunately. Otherwise, that would have been a two prime targets right there. I don't think I need all six units here, to be honest. That's a lot for those. Oh, there's the other two are coming towards me. They're going to start shooting at these three units, but once I get in there, they won't be able to do much. Where are these arrows going? Get fucked, men! Actually, just kind of charge through. I might just have to half sacrifice these men, just get some charges off, make it so they're not shooting at me anymore. As long as these Yari aren't responding, there's no reason for me not to keep doing this. I should have brought these other three over as well, to be honest. Let's 
Oh, Morgan is shooting me from over there as well now. These men will win overall, but I don't like losing this much calf either, so I'm gonna pull them back. They'll follow me for a minute. I will charge these two, these four units in. Take over, men! Meanwhile, our archers are peppering them as well. They're being peppered as well by that unit there, though. Little bit of pepper. Some mediocre uphill charges, but I think they're wounded enough that we'll be able to kill them pretty quickly. I'll take one of you guys out of here. He's charging there, actually. Let's go around. If I surround them, they'll route instantly. Oh, they've already broken. We can get at these guys as well. This <laughs> fucking Yar unit's not responding. Sir, there's cavalry there! That's We're really good against those guys, because we have long pointy sticks. No, no, uh, clearly I put my arch at the front for a reason. They know what they're doing. Just leave them be. Just, you know, they gotta, they gotta prove themselves. Can't always come to the rescue with our long pointy spears now, can we? Alright, so they've got one archer left. I have two. So we now have officially got ranged advantage. Are they true? Let's hold on. Let's hold, hold back for a second. They might actually be coming... No, they're not coming towards me. They're just shifting. They're facing towards these two guys now. What is going on? Okay, you guys go... F actually, don't go forward. They'll run into your range in a minute anyway. Uh, but yeah, like, if we can actually manage to kill their final archer, wherever it is, there it is, um, then we will... Then we'll be able to. Then they'll probably just come charging at me. But for now, yeah. If you, if you want to sit there, let me shoot at you. I'll happily do that too. Uh, I'm just thinking. Maybe what that person meant is that the um, the icon is actually the faction leader. I don't think their faction leader is in this army. So maybe that's what it is. But that's not very reliable then, because I mean, 99. Well, not 99. Quite a few of the battles you fight aren't going to be against a general like an enemy daimyo. Okay, now they've actually got annoyingly their archer behind other stuff. I can't get in there with Cav now. So, unless I can? There's one unit in the way. I mean, I could just kill them with archers. We are killing them, but they're killing me probably faster than I'm killing them. This is fucking... We're not... Look at this. <laughs> they're so close. They're not like... They don't care at all. You know what? I think this is actually... We just set up a, a, a perimeter now. We're just going to Yarrival up there. We can go over here. Don't need you there. Uh, it's not even remotely accurate. It doesn't matter. Alright. No, don't run away, you fucking bitch. Well, at least the archer moving. No, they're not. Archer are moving away. Oh, in that case. I have some cab with your name on it. Let's go, men. Time to slaughter. I kind of want them to come down towards me, so if I can kill this final archer, there's a good chance they will just uh, charge down afterwards. You guys should go out of the area walk, so it makes you tired. Hopefully they'll instantly just come charging towards me. Nice little volley in the back of our own men. Well done. Let's just move around for a second. Could be that this unit routes and then instantly all that shit's gonna fucking sprint. You'll see all the abilities activated and stuff, but whether that actually happens, I don't know. It doesn't always. Either way, I'm gonna run back the moment it happens. No, they're not responding to it. Alright, well, we now have archers and they don't, so I'm just gonna move up, start shooting at them until they run towards me. Animating. I'm just gonna set up a wall. A longer wall, actually. I'll take these two over right here as well. I'll just keep one on the flank. All right. Oh, are they? No, they're still they're still just moving around because these units are going the wrong way. Uh, fire away, boys! As you were. Uh, let's get some cav over to the flanks as well, shall we? Let's take some uh, weaker units with these guys. Split up the uh, difference a little bit. Fire! Did they have an archer come back from routing or something? They didn't, right? 
I don't think so. No, I think I think they just think they have they still they can still beat me basically. The AI is like, oh yeah, you can come up on this hill. Like your your men will just get defeated on the hill. If I can kill enough of them, they'll reconsider that. But for now, they're they seem to be quite content with sitting up on their on their nice little hill. Are you guys coming? Oh no, you're just lining up over there. I was gonna say, are they coming towards my castle for some reason? Oh fuck. Um. Oh, it's their it's their Yari Ashigaru. All right. Uh, I am just gonna charge them. I'm not gonna even get the water going to Yari Wall. I want to just touch them because otherwise they're gonna do that. And I don't know if I'll be able to reach them to be honest. Fuck it. I'm not gonna bother. Oops. Oh, or will I? They turn around. It's okay. Yeah, I'm not going into Yari Wall, which is obviously not great, but not nor are they. And they've got half the men, or a quarter if you combine the two. So it's all good. I do want to route this unit before... Uh, I don't know if I need this, but I'll get a general over there just to get a charge to the back. I want to route them before these guys were to get over here, because I do want them back in the line. Get back in line, boys! Okay, they've routed. It's broken. Make sure we kill a few more of them, why not? Alright, archers, you still have ammo. Uh, let's move a little bit. We should be able oh, we're actually still firing right now. Okay, just make sure I move the general back in time. Yeah, let's not get any closer. 14, they might have survived that, but it's okay. Right, why the fuck are you not responding? What is this? You still have plenty of ammo, but for some reason you're not firing. Why not? One of our units has used He's all its ammunition, my lord. Alright, well, let's get you to fire some more. I mean, if I have to, I'll go up the hill and fucking kill him, but... It just seems a bit awkward that I should have to. Pick up more- pick up the arrows that the enemy fired at us! More ammo! These bastards, they One think of our so units has used oh all its ammunition, my lord! actually run out of ammo. They, they think they're so cool with their short spears. Alright, well, I guess I will go up on the hill after all. I'm gonna take... What is this? What is what is this? What is this? Get back in line. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna leave two units out there. I'm gonna send you guys, like, up here somewhere. Ugh, maybe one less. You unsubordinate guy who's not in proper formation. Go away. Uh, just walk. And then you can kind of sit here. Oh, that works. You can sit there. That doesn't work. That'll do. Cavalry get a wee bit closer. You guys can walk. Yari Key? What is this fucking... Fall of the Samurai? They're gonna go around. You're gonna go in Yari Wall now, because I don't want to risk them charging into me now. You're gonna do the old flankery now. Alright, and you guys are all walking. Eh, I don't need to go into Yari Wall yet. I am gonna start running up here now. Run, men! There's a chance that if I touch one of these, the others will... I don't know what the fuck's going on, actually. Because I, I was going to say, they'll all start charging towards me. But this is the second battle in a row against the Oda, where they're just, like, not interested in fighting. They're like, yeah, god, I guess we'll just die. It's fine. Alright. Uh, you know what? Why don't you go kill the generals? I think that's a good job for you. Three units, they're all a bit wounded, but that should be okay. Don't go that way. Take the long way around. Don't go for the Mines of Moria. Oh, here we go. Oh, fuck. Ah! Okay, put him in Yari Wall. That was a little bit a little bit risky there, I gotta say. Uh, okay, just, just move off, I guess. Oh, shit. Um, right, this is fine. You guys, just move into the other units, please, because even though you are... Yari Ashigaru will definitely beat a unit of Yari Sam like this, so I still don't like... You know, they're downhill. Don't want to take any chances, really. Alright. This should all be good. 
Uh, generals, you might want to come over as well, why not? Give your, give your, um, verbal support, if you will. I kind of don't want to charge the generals until this unit fucks off, though. Or I get something else to occupy that unit. Okay, so far, these battlers are going okay. That's all I want. Ooh, we got a fucking Mexican standoff over here. Alright, the others are far enough away. Let's get in there, boys. I don't know about these odds of uh, these three against two, so I'm actually going to send these guys around as well. It'll take a while to get there, but it should be helpful. You guys can run. Are you not running, you son of a bitch? If you can just not touch this unit, they won't even respond. Oh, very close to touching, though. Oh, the, the guy who was about to touch them died. Good. Yes. Death. Exactly what I want. Alright, walk into them as well, please. I'm not even watching the other battles because I know they're going to go well. Although that one's not going as well as I was hoping. Um, in fact, yeah, none of these are going particularly well for being completely honest with one another. Let's get you out of there. You've done your job. It's time for the other three to take over. And we routed one unit as well. Uh, oh, there's the unit. Oh, I can't... Okay, it's annoying. Couldn't charge them anymore. Oh shit, we got charged in the back. Get in there, boys. Help them out. We're not doing as well as I was hoping because I am not paying attention as much as I should be. Um, yeah, the fact that we haven't routed a single unit yet is incredibly frustrating. I'm not gonna lie. We're charging here, might be able to route them. Oh, we actually had a route. Is that a calf? Yeah. Oh shit, because we got charged in the back by these guys. Oh, why aren't you charging? Okay. It's going uh, horrendously poorly, actually. I'm, uh, I, I should have played this quite a bit better, I'm not gonna lie. But I think we almost have a master on our hands. Yeah, there we go. In fact, there goes all of this as well. This unit's not performing as highly as I would have liked. But there you go. Okay, um... Yeah, that was poor. We lost two cav units. I don't think any of them will be dead altogether, but still. Victory indeed. But at what cost? Uh, yeah, that was that was not as clean as I would have liked. I mean, you know, if you look at the numbers, we've still got a couple units that are pretty healthy. Almost all of them, in fact. There's three of them that aren't. And a calf. But, yeah, it's okay. That's not actually as bad as it looks. But uh, it could have gone better. I think I overestimated my Yari Ashigaru a little bit there. They did, they, they underperformed. I'll say. Um, am I fucking blind? Where's all my cab at? Oh, here we go. See, I knew I had one standing around doing fuck all. There we go. You're killing that unit. We're gonna have almost wiped out the entire enemy force. I don't know if we killed the enemy general, though. There's something there, but I can't fucking tell what it is. General, but was it zero out of something? I'll never know. I think they're actually, yeah, they're sort of off the actual map. Alright, quit that. Close victory. Eh. I say so. I don't know if I would have classified it as that, but... Fair enough. It wasn't clean. It wasn't decisive. It should it should just be victory. Just just a victory. You won. Wasn't great. Wasn't terrible. Victory. They should add that in. They call it... They just call it just victory. It... <laughs> I don't know. I was gonna say indecisive victory, but no, it was decisive, but it wasn't decisive in the way that the game uses the word decisive. You get my meaning? My SSD is definitely getting slower. This is taking far longer to load nowadays than it was before. Alright, we lost a thousand men. We still killed, you know, two and a half thousand almost, so overall things are okay. We didn't lose any units, that's good. Half tempted to merge them though, because our replenishment's gonna be pretty shit, but I don't think I will. Um, who performed well? The light calf, yeah. No, no real surprises there. They did a lot of the work against the archers. Right, so we didn't kill the main general, I think. And I won't be today. Right, so next time we're gonna have to take the town. I think what I will do is probably send back these two units next turn. Maybe even... No, I don't know. I might just... Uh, 
Yeah, no, I think if I send these two away, I won't lose anything, but I might just attack it without the calf just to make sure I don't actually lose any men, because the game likes to take... Like, if I attack this, it'll probably give me either zero losses... What the... Why is the four broken? It'll give me either zero losses, or it will... Um, give me... Like, it'll kill off my two weakest units or something like that, which is why I want to take them out. Plus, I need to go over towards this force anyway, so... All good. Yeah, the force broken for whatever reason. Oh, it's because I did that with my ninja, right. Well, that's good, because hopefully they'll re repair that, and also the they're building the roads up for me, which is quite nice. Although, if they'd done that before, I probably would have been able to reach in a single turn, and we would never have had all of this stuff happen, but, you know, so be it. Anyway, uh, I think that's it for this turn. Strategy defense coming in next turn. Let's see what happens. it be an interesting turn right here. Okay, they got reinforced, but then moved away immediately. They're not recruiting any exception, I know. I busted at the castle anyway, so... No! You pricks! Alright, well, I'm gonna have to leave Etchu then. I'm just gonna go back and take Kaga. I don't wanna risk anything else, because they, if, they, if they're not gonna take it... Oh no, I didn't sabotage an army. That's too bad. Right, we're gonna go for Heaven and Earth right now. Clan destroyed. Is it someone I know? Uh, maybe. Sakai. Oh, right, who, who killed them? Datori, yeah, that's fine. They are my ally, after all. Right, so this is gonna be... I mean, if I go Yari Drawyer, I can get Yari Cab. But if I go Encampment, and then I believe it's the Charging one. The Proving Grounds. I believe that will then allow me to recruit Fire Cab, which are, of course, the prime Takeda unit. Yeah, it's the Stables and Proving Grounds, so we could do that. Actually, I think the pro you don't even need the War Horse Stables, do you? You could just use the regular Stables. Yeah. Um... But anyway, yeah, so we want to recruit Fire Calf. Lots of them, because they're fucking brilliant. So you're going to move back. You're not going to replenish, unfortunately, because you're not in town. Just about. Could have sent them with this general, I guess, but yeah, whatever. And then I'm actually going to take out all of the weak units, just in case they take... The, the game is like, oh, I'm going to kill them off for you. So we'll not take them. I'll lose zero men right now. Three men, whatever. Three is basically zero. And then we'll move them back in. I wonder if I can actually attack these guys. Can you sabotage them? 61%. Not terrible, to be honest. I might actually do that. If I could kill them off right now, that'd be pretty good. Although, again, we are wounded, so I'd have to... You know what? I might just sabotage them anyway. Let's just see if it works, first of all. There's also a very solid chance that I'll block myself in by doing this, so... Okay, so we did succeed, so now I have a decision to make. I almost wanted to fail, just so I don't have a decision to make. I could chase them up. What the fuck? They got firebomb throwers. Who absolute mad lad. Um, I think I'll chase them up and I'll um, I'll just I'll just um, I'll just you know I'll just do something. I think is what I'll do. Uh, no, I'll just I'll just fight it manually. Maybe I'm not sure. Right, so here's the uh, decision of a lifetime. Do I wait for the Iku Iki to take Etu, which I don't know what the fuck they're doing. They may just wait another turn. Or do I just take Kaga to be done with it? I don't like you. I know you're a monk from, you know, from my side, but I don't like you. You can get some good experience from this, actually, so let's start with that either way. Nice, that will level you up. Good man! 10% chance of one detection, or plus one, I'll take the 10%. Right, so Kaga is important. Much more important than Etsu, but... There is the chance that I can take both. Ooh, I hadn't even considered this. Right, hold on. So this is actually a thing. If I if if they take Etsu, I actually get teleported away from here. So I wouldn't even be able to take Kaga anymore, and I wouldn't be able to take Etsu in a single turn either. So my whole plan... Would have backfired on me if they had taken that shoot. So yeah, let's just fucking suck it and just take Kaga. Uh, ooh, I need to move first. <laughs> if I declared war on them right now, I would actually not be able to move because I'm in their reinforcement. So I'd have to go and attack them. They would run away. Then I'd have to go reach Kaga, but I'm not sure if I'd still be able to. So first we move away, and then we declare war. I'm not going to call my allies to help. And then they instantly die. Goodbye. And all the armies are gone. So we kind of saved... The Jimbo with that and they hate me and they will never know because that's not how the game works it's not like oh you saved me from an inevitable death 
plus 50 of diplomacy or something. But still. Uh, right, so Ico's still going up, but next turn, once that temple's busted, it's gonna be okay. Our income has drastically gone up. Very nice. Uh, they unfortunately didn't upgrade the blacksmith at all. So yeah, we've still got a long ways to go before we can actually get good units from here, but either way, good shit. Uh, we can't afford to build anything. Can I... I can recruit a unit somewhere, I guess. Do I want to... I don't need one in Hida. I don't need anyone for happiness. And I don't think I need to spend my money on that right now, so let's not. Alright. Uh, Oda. Do you want to peace out now? Wow. Yeah, I think I'm going to kill him. I'm going to fucking kill him. They've got... Oh, wow. It's actually three... <laughs> it's three archers. Six men... Well, it's two and a half archers. Not even that. Um, six men from a general unit and fire one first. So cavalry is actually really strong, but it's also the cav that I kind of want to leave behind. I'll definitely leave behind these three wounded units, because I'm not going to use them at all. Um, if I fight this one manually, I should bring the cav. If I'm going to auto-resolve it, I shouldn't bring the cav. But I think if I auto-resolve, it's not going to be that clear-cut. So I think I'll just bring the cav and just fight it manually. Oh wow, no, that is very clear-cut. I think I can just auto-resolve that. Please don't kill my cav off. Thank you. Okay, that's even better. Goodbye. Can't make it back into South Shinano, at least not with everything. How happy... Or sorry, not how happy. Uh, no, how, how much would you want to peace out now? They yeah. do, because I just noticed, I think... Yeah, they've lost uh, Mikawa to the Imagawa. So my ally is actually finally going on the offensive. Unfortunately, they've done it now, after I've dealt with all the armies, and they're just going to mop up, take all the towns. I don't necessarily even want to take Mino, so what I might do... Which could be interesting... I don't... I'm not gonna advance right now anyway, so I think what I'll do is I'll move to the border, so I have the option to advance. Actually, it depends on how happy this place is. Uh, no, that should be fine. We can always exempt it. We should be okay there. Um, so what I could do is I could wait for the Imigawa to take out Owari, and then I could vassalize the, the Oda. I think that's what I'll probably do, because I think that'd be kind of funny. Vassalizing the Oda. Probably a terrible idea, I'm sure it'll betray me, but... It's, it's kind of funny, and that sometimes trumps everything else. They would also lose their, their alliance with Akita Batake, which is positive for me, because it means that, you know, they're two individuals rather than a combined force. So yeah, let's hope that the Imagawa does that right away. Again, I'm not going to go on the offensive anyway, so I'll just move up to the border. So I can, I can still replenish. I wouldn't have made it back into Sashinano anyway. And that way I have the option of advancing. I'll probably next turn will be able to make it to like right there. So I could go and take Mino next turn if I wanted to. But if I take Mino, it's just gonna open up a whole another shebang of stuff there. Oh my god, the Hattori lost their capital. No! Wait. <laughs> The fucking Imagawa took Mino! <laughs> you bastards! Why did you go past the war- Wait, actually, they might still vassalize, so that's- it's, Technically, it's fine. But I would have preferred if it was bordering me. You are here, All right. like an honest man what at the, the front gate. Better that as a Stupid Imagawa. We also, for some reason, we got a tactical withdrawal, even though we aren't- We weren't in their territory at all. So I'm not sure where the fuck that came from, but there you go. Also, the Oda are- very desperate for peace. It's not even um, Oda Nobunaga, it's o Oda Gozen. So I guess o Nobunaga is probably not even old enough yet. Or he died elsewhere, that's possible too. I'm not sure what age he comes of age. I think he does start off like 12 or something in the game. Also, holy fuck, how much money are you going to pay me? I didn't mean to pay uh, to do 8900 8, there, but it, it's fine. 7500 They said yes to 7 grand, right? Yeah, they did, okay. Uh, seven, eight. Oh. It's gonna be a good turn right here, boys. Alright, seven, eight. You know what? Nah, fuck it. Seven, eight, fifty is what I'll take. Okay, seven, eight hundred then. You drive a hard bargain, sir, but... Oh, you got me by the balls here. Uh, alright, cool. Thanks, mate. So yeah, they lose their alliance. No more talk. No more talk. Uh, I now can trade with the Hatakiyama and the Waisugi again. Oh, they've taken back their town. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm noted, but the bar is broken for some reason. I'm assuming it's 
Oh! Okay, I've never had that bug before. It's actually just broken. Well, okay, we're noted, so we're like a third on the way there or something, or a quarter, I'm not sure. Um, okay, right. Uh, yeah, so the, the, the Waisugi have actually taken that back, so I'm considering if I can declare war on the gym, but I don't think I can yet. Oh, fuck no, well, we definitely can't because we made the new deal, of course. Okay, well, that's fine. Right, so this is going to be a recruitment province, so we're definitely going to build recruitment buildings here. What are we going to start with? I think just a good old sword school. Not a bad idea. Unless I want to build a Buddhist temple. If I want to get warrior monks. Which... Maybe? Uh, I'm definitely going to upgrade the... Right, I haven't even considered this yet. What am I going to go for? What kind of armies? I'm, I mean, I'm going to have lots of calves, so probably offensive armies more than defensive armies. There's a good chance I will not even... I'll, I'll have probably have some armies that don't even have archers in them. So... Melee attack certainly seems to make more sense. So we go Weaponsmith, we get plus four. And then if we build the encampment up to Armory, we get two. What is it, melee attack again? It's also two. So I think we go for four melee attack and two armor. I think that's the go-to. So I could certainly make Warrior Monks. Do I want to right away? So for them, I... Well, I mean, if I build a sword score, I can get Katana a Samurai right away, which is definitely what I need first, I think. Yari, Sam... I can build the Naganata Dojo, so I can get Naga Naganata Sam, but I'm not going to use many Naganata Sam if I'm going for very offensive armies, whereas I am going to use... Yeah, I'll just build a sword school. It's a safe bet. I do kind of want a Buddhist temple, but if I need build a Buddhist temple, I'll also need... Um... The Yari drill yard upgraded, and then I'll need an encampment, so I need to have level 3 fort, or level 4 even. And then I won't be able to recruit much else, so yeah, let's just go for sword school. I might I might eventually also get uh, other units, but for now, we'll do that. We'll upgrade that too, because we got the cash. In fact, I think I can probably upgrade everything I possibly want to upgrade right now. Uh, this is going to... Wait for the encampment because I want fire cap more than Yari. This is gonna have to be a sake then. Upgrade that, that, and that. Still got 510 bucks left over. Right, you guys. Gonna move into Hida. I still have two turns of movement left over. If I want to get there, I'd have to do it now, don't I? Yeah, it's gonna end. <laughs> it's gonna end. Okay, so I have to not get my um, replenishing right now because otherwise I can't make it. I need to go right now. I know that's a messed up. Um, okay, I guess check out the Jimbo, see what they've got. Because if they declare war on me or my uh, my military access breaks for whatever reason, if they break it or something, I'd love to declare war on them soon. Uh, and then back here, yeah, you're just gonna chill, I think, for the moment. Currently, our, we don't even have a target right now. I think we start focusing on the East soon, because if the Waisugi do somehow die, or, you know, this guy dies or whatever, we might have a threat on our eastern border. Whereas right here, we're basically safe. We have an ally here, Atori, who I think we probably have good relations with. Yeah, we're very friendly. We can actually trade with him as well. Are you going to pay me ludicrous Come amounts as well? Be seated. I, will order tea, I think we, and we will actually have were trading at one point, and then it got broken, right? Because they, uh, they lost Omi, or I think it was Omi. Um, did you say yes to two grand? No, you didn't. Okay, hold on. Oh, sorry, sorry, my friend. I still think this whole negotiating is just hilarious. Like, hey, will you pay me a thousand? Yes, sir. Uh, good deal. Oh, okay. Well, would you pay me two thousand then? Uh, well, I suppose. Oh, great. Will you pay me three thousand? Uh, no, I don't think so. All right, twenty-five hundred. Um, I guess. Just like back and forth until you get the exact number that you want. Did I already try 1900? I think I did. Did I try 1950? Right, they said... Again, just check that. They said, they said no to 2000. Okay, so 1950 it is. Alright, cool. Um, look, <laughs> my boss told me not to come home until I have the absolute best deal available. So we're going to sit here until you tell me exactly how much you want to get paid. Or how much you want to pay me. Well. Now speak of your Oof, wishes that's a crap and deal. Will you pay me 10? They pay me 50. Fucking haggling over a 50 bucks still. 100. Alright, fine, I'll take 100. Uh, yep, sounds good. Anyone else? Yes, the Waisugi again. We're no longer so very friendly friend, with them. Of what do you wish to talk? I wish to talk of some 
fat ass trade so you can get some sweet ass war horses the thing I'm uh, famed for all right income is almost two grand we still have 2600 again now what will we do oh Metsuke that's such a great fucking agent why have I not got any yet uh, right, so this place would actually have been happy... No, it wouldn't. I would have to recruit a unit otherwise, but it's okay. We are just gonna... Chill out, though, I think, in South Shinano. I don't... Like I said, I don't really have anywhere to go right now. I could run back, but we may as well just sit here for a turn, make this place happy, and then move on. I have a ninja in this area. Well, that's this guy here. I think I'll... Probably keep him on the eastern front, and then I'll send this guy west. I don't know what he needs to do west, because, again, we have... We're pretty safe on our western front. I think the western front is the most safe we have, so maybe I should send the second one east as well. I can recruit a new one here in two turns anyway, yeah, so let's send you east as well. Like, we could be one town away from uh, from being at war, because the Hojo haven't expanded past Musashi yet, so if anyone takes Shimosa, or takes Sh uh, Musashi and they might not like me, we could be at war sooner than we'd like. But I think we'll be okay. Right, so I can upgrade. Actually, well, I'll upgrade this. I was gonna say I can upgrade some uh, sake dens, but I don't think I need to. We have predicted free food. All Gucci. Okay, uh, I think that is it. Diplomacy we have checked, so let's end the turn, and then I'll probably end the episode there as well. Are the Ho actually? I don't think the Oda can get killed anymore now. Okay, the Waisugi again. We're still allied with them, but they've got a pretty large army over there. If they take out the Jimbo and they get they get uh, ideas, yeah, the uh, Imagawa <laughs> can no longer take out the Oda, which is not kind of funny. Now they kind of wish they hadn't taken Mino, but they've taken the Wari, I think, because <laughs> they have they need to move all their forces like this now around the fucking. And there's actually a bridge they have to take, which I think it's over here. I just can't quite see it, but uh, yeah, they have to take a bridge as well. So they're wasting a lot of movement doing that. Which is very funny to me, but not to them. Our military access expiring, right? Okay, I thought I said expired for a second. So I, yeah, I need to get them in there and then otherwise we can't anymore. Ito is also Christian. That happens a lot. Anyway, that'll be that for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. A uh, decent bit of expansion this time. Took a couple of towns. Looking good so far. Until next time, have a good day and goodbye.